All right, we're on in the finals. Usid versus Deacon. We're starting off. We got Lulu with the pull. You can hear you can hear Super getting excited. It's a pull. It's a big one. That might be out the back actually. Oh no, it's just in. Caught by Tallboy on Deacon. Don't know his name. Sent centered to number five. He's looking up. He's looking up. Up the line, but it's blocked by Dave from Sufa. And they're slowly walking up. Got a Sufa guy in front of me. Just noticed that I am commentating the whole game. It's picked up by Lulu. He's looking. He's looking. Not a lot's happening. Oh, it's an upline cut by Kirsty. He sends it. Oh, and then saved out the back by number 70. That is a goal for Sufa right at the start. We're gonna get a big pull right now. It's up, it's Blady. They gotta stop the roll. Solid stop by that big boy number 11. Send it to number eight. He's looking, up the line, back up. He's looking deep but he's not getting it. Number 14 gets it, he points up, sends it up the line. He is clear and that's an easy goal for Deacon. Well done, that's, that's one all. Deacon's very happy about it. Very happy. First offensive point by Sufa. It's a big pull by Deacon. Quite low, but makes the field. Picked up by Lockie. Pass to Molly, number 11. Back to Lockie. Back to Molly. And they are working, they are working it up the field real quick. Oh, that is a tight cup. But it's back to Molly. She's looking big. Lucky crashes. He's a, he's just standing around now. Oh, big hammer across field to number 40. Number 40 drops it back to number 33. And he hammers it back. This is Hammer Central. We're at Bloody Bunnings Warehouse right now. And that's a lovely upline. But blocked by Deacon. You can hear, you can hear the Deacon students loving it right now. But that's a quick turn as well for Deacon. Picked up by Molly. Sends it immediately to number 40. Layout, miss. Number 22 slowly walking to the disc. Doesn't have a care in the world right now. It's like he doesn't even know he's in the gold medal match of uni games. Ultimate Frisbee. Disgusting. <laughs> All right, we've got a quick cut and he's looking deep. No, he's turned back around. Lucky on the mark, not letting anything go through. It's up, very close to the sideline. We've knocked over the scoreboard. He's looking, he's turned. Just a low one. Number seven's got it. He's looking up line, he's looking up line. He's looking at his dump, he's looking at his dump. Nah, and that's an easy intercept. lucky has got it, no mark, so he's got all the time he needs. Quick to Molly. Molly senses it. All right, we've got it on the sideline. He centers it to Lockie. Lockie's big fake. Back to number 33. Everyone's gone very quiet now. Swings it to Molly. And it's, it's into space. Deacon with another chance on this point. Number 22 going for the disc again. He's, a, he's taking his time, very casual walk, I'd say. You know, like, it's pretty chill. We've been we've set up in a vertical stack again. Nice pass up to 42. 42 is doing some pivots, but not getting a lot of throws out of his hand right now. Oh, nice pass to 24. She keeps it. Bit of a fumble. That's okay. She's looking, she's looking at 17, but Fisher Day is getting him right now. It's gonna be a contest in the air, and it's out. Ooh. Got Sufa taking it from the sideline. Lucky is telling the team what to do. Really dictating the play right now. He's it's up. 
to Fisher. Fisher, easy throw over the crowd to JJ. And that's a <laughs> JJ does spike it into Molly. And that's 2-1 for Sufa. All right, and it's a pull by Lulu again. Deacon starting on offense. It's just floating down and it's, is he calling a brick? So we got Wes on the mark right now, standing a bit back. He's trying to block one of those bigger throws. Ooh, and that's a quick turn. Just a fumble by number 14. Everyone's running through. Quick pass to the end zone. He's very open. And that's a catch by Dave. Number 42. Sufa taking it. Another point. And that's 3-1. Deacon on offense. Lulu with the pull. It's Blady. It's coming in. That's going to have a bit of a roll. I think they're just going to let it roll out the back there. And he's bringing it to the front of the line. We've got number 70 on the mark. He's hard on it. Force and flick, force and flick, but that is a break right there. They're forcing flick again. Force and flick with Liam Varley on the mark. That's another break, that's two in a row. Number 14 catching, and he's looking to send it, but he's blocked. Back to number eight. He's, he's looking, it's through, it's down. They're just letting it roll at this point. Back. Lulu's going to pick up from the center of the field. Molly back as second handler. He's looking. He's activated his dump. She's cleared Varley into the space. Varley's looking to center it back to Lulu. Up to Molly. And number 70 with a goal. That's 4-1 that's for you, Sid. Sufa's really taking it early in this game. Some clear confident strategies. Lulu with the pull again. A lot flatter, but it. Yeah, is it gonna stay in? Just stays in. Caught by number six. Up the line to eight. He's looking. It's backhand force. Huge layout by Lulu. Ab absolutely sensational. That's another layout, but it's up the field and it goes to no one. Lulu walking up to the line, number 14 on him. Waz a bit behind. Centers it to Waz. Back to Lulu. Up line to Waz. And he's looking deep. He's looking deep for Pat Sparks. It's bounce off number 22's. Double layout by Pat and number five. But no luck for them. Deacon back on offense. I'm hearing confusing calls from the sideline of only unders and no unders. So I guess that's no throws then. We'll see what happens. It's number six on the mark. Under to number 17, who's looking pretty confident. Back up to six, but it is down. <laughs> the slow. Lulu picking up the disc. It's up to number six. And she's... She's looking for Lulu, but it's, it's not happening. Number 14 is on it. But number 23 gets it. That is Patrick Sparks. But it's a pick, so just kidding. He didn't get it. <laughs> it's back to the thrower. She's looking straight for Lulu. He's gone. Number 16 up the line, but just out. And she's looking to get that final assist into the goal. It's getting close. Ooh, he was very open, very suddenly open in the middle of the field. That's number 90, Lulu, taking the score to 5-1. Deacon on offense. Lockie, Lockie about to make the pull. It's big. It's a little bit bladey, but it should still land in. Looks like it landed in, then rolled it out. A very lucky shot. 
would have just, just nicked the edge of the field. Number 14 walking up. What I don't understand is how he's playing in track pants. It is a, it is a sweaty day today, and that guy, not a care in the world in his track pants. We got Lockie on the mark. Immediately broken. Number 17 has it, and he is in power position, but he waits. He holds off, looking to pass it to his other handler. They're getting some good plays upfield. Number 14 slowing it down. Cross field to number 10. Up to number 5. He's looking. He's looking. He's, he cannot get it to his handler. Ooh. Huge layout by number 10, but not getting it. All right, they're, they're setting up a vert stack. Oh, not a vert stack. Maybe a vert stack? They're kind of all over the place. Oh, they're setting up a T stack. There we go. Oh, he's looking long. No, nah, small pass to number 42, Dave. He's looking long to number three. Be just bounces out of her hands. You hate to see it. Slowly walking back to the disc. Very chill, very calm. Oh, we've got a couple shouts for thrower, but he is quieting down. Lucky on the mark. Oh, it's a pass up to 17. I feel like we've seen that before. And a pass up to four. He's, look he's looking for his other handler. And great up line, but knocked down. Would have thought it was a strip, but no call. All right. Molly slowly walking up to the disc. She's, she's looking upfield. Immediate centre, but it's just a bit too floaty, but number 33 gets it. He sends it up the line to number 42. He's right in, right in that corner, really edging that sideline. He gets it up the line to number 33 again. And an easy pass to Lockie White, number one. Making it 6-1 for Sufa. Solid, solid lead. Sufa about to send it to Deacon on offense. It's got a solid roll, but it is going out into the Deacon fans. I don't know if they've ever played Frisbee those fans over there. Oof, that throw does not indicate it. <laughs> I really hope that was caught on the live stream. That other Deacon students throw to a Deacon Frisbee player. We've got number 14 with the disc. He centers it to eight, but it, it goes past. And Sufa is pretty chill with their run up to the disc. Who's picking it up? We got Lulu picking it up. Fisher Day is pretty open right now, and uh, makes sense the pass goes right to him. He's looking. He gets it back to Lulu. He passes it up line to number five. Number five is looking. She's looking, she's looking. Oh, it's up, it's Blady. But Lulu gets it. Just a huge grab. He's looking. He's looking. And that's a cross to Varley. And that's a goal. 7-1. Sufa is taking it. Lulu with the pull. Real blady this one. He's going for that roll. And it worked. Pick up by number 22, center to six, back to 22. But we've got a, we've got a force home happening right now. He's looking for his other handler, but that's a foot block. <laughs> that's, a, that's a lovely foot block. And they have it on the goal line. This is to take half as well. It's a nice blade to no one. All right, number 22 has it. He's looking at his other handler, but she's not moving up. Oh, she's gonna get it, she's gonna get it. Nope, that's down. And we have it. Lulu's slowly walking to pick it up. This again is to take half. Picks it up. Quick to Maddie. 
That's a goal. Lovely layout. That's 8-1 for Sufa. That's half time. Second half started with pull from Deacon to Sufa. It's a bit blady, stopped by Lockie. Sent it to Molly. It's zone look, zone look. Looks like a four person cup. But that is swung back to the other side. Number 40 centers it to JJ. Up to Fisher. Fisher to Molly. Molly holds it to Lockie. Back to Fisher. They are playing this all the way up the sideline. Back to Lockie. And uh, I think he's going for something. Ah, oh, nah. Just back to Molly. Swings it to number 33. Across the field to a very open super player. And she takes the goal. That was... Who knows who that was? That was number five. Well done, number five. That's 9-1 for Sufa. Taking the first point of the second half. Let's get this point started. That's a nice bladey one. Across the field. Tried to stop the roll. Didn't quite stop it in time. Centered to six. So it's a bit of a weird zone right now. Cross to 14. And he passes it to number five. Oh, layout to nowhere by it, number 90. Number 14 still looking up. Gets it across the field to number five. Back to 14, back to five, back to 14. This next row, probably back to five. Oh, no, it's actually up the field to number 22. Centers it to five, but that's down. Even a tremendous layout by... Don't know his name, he is still down. And it looks like that's going to be an injury call. He's been replaced by number seven. He's tapping it in, and it's a turn. Sufa to pick up. They're setting a vert stack. Very quick cut from number 70. Oh, it's in a cross field. Floaty. Floaty. About four guys in there. And that's a catch by number 23, Patrick Sparks. A late addition to the team as well, but he, he made up for it with that goal just then. Sky and two Deacon guys and one of his own teammates. And that's 10-1 to Sufa. We're about to get the pull from Lulu to Deacon. Nice outside in. Get the roll on it. A couple of people trying to stop it. Stopped. Got number six to number eight. He's looking big. Nice back and forth with number four. Number 14's got it. He's got no mark, so he's just, he's sending it with a huge hammer. It's floating just enough, and that's caught by number 42. Well done, Deacon. They're very excited. Understandably, because the score is now 10-2. Taking back that point. Stop and use his streak. Going to get a pull from... Number 22, Deacon, in a stylish bucket hat. He's pulling it for Sufa on offense. And he's gone with a lovely inside out to get that roll, but it stopped. Almost a layout just to stop it. You've got to appreciate that commitment. She's looking, gets it to 33. 33 sends it up the line to perfect spacing, but it's just a bit far for number five. All right, we've got number seven streaming deep but it's not coming to him. You get an up the line, no up the line. It's an across to 22. He's, he's sent it long. And number four has buckets of space, but oof, that's rough. It's a drop from number four. Oh, <laughs> wow. An absolute ripper layout by number 22 just then. But his throw went out. But wow, what a layout. Perfect interception. All right. UC got lucky with that throw just then. They're back on offense. Lockie, number one, picking up the disc. 
taking her up to the line. Number 22 on the mark, maybe he'll get another layout. He's looking deep. Nah. Inside cut from number 40. Sends it up the sideline to number 5. This time it's good. Oof! And just didn't quite stay in the hands. Got a bit of a fumble and Deacon's back on offense. Very quick to start that stall. He's looking around, he's looking at his handler. Yeah, got it, number 24. Keeps it going up, keep that swing going. Number 22, absolute thrower right now. Back to 24. Down the middle, but perfectly intercepted by number 33. And he's looking, he's not getting a lot. Sends it across field to number 40. Pops it easily to Lockie. Lockie chases the throw, but gets it up line to Molly. He gets it quick. Ooh, a bit too quick for her receiver. JJ was not quite there. Still, for, still forcing that backhand. Really trying to use the wind against them. He's looking long. Back to his handler. His handler gets real close. She gets it. That's number 24. Trying to get it back to number five. Could not get it. Number seven gets it. He's passing it to 22, who doesn't seem to have a mark. Oh, there's Lucky. <laughs> number 22 sends it up the line. Oh, huge jump. Did not get it. All right, we've got Lucky going to pick up the disc. There you go. He's on the sideline. Deacon forcing flick with you sit in a horror, horror stack right now. Swings it towards the center. Keeps the swing going. Pops it up. And we've got two different Deacon players ready to grab it down. Got number 22 looking long. Oof, very close. Almost intercepted. Back to 22. No line, bro. He's looking. He's floating it up, floating it up. Lots of float. And it just went over his receiver. Don't think, don't think she counted enough for the wind. And that's another turn in this very long point. After multiple very quick points, it's nice to see Deacon bringing it back. Getting those turns. You sit on offense. And 40 absolutely toasted his mark, but was nowhere to be seen. We've got Lockie White poached pretty, pretty open. And he's looking long. Back to 33. He sends it long to number something. Too many players in the way. And it's a turnover. 2 to 22. And that's a goal. Yeah, and the way that was almost a call just then, but no, that's a goal. And that's 10-3. 10-3. Alright, Deacon sending it to you, Sid. Lovely float. I don't think it's making it back into the field though. It's into the stands and it's caught by a lucky fan. Can't take the disc home though. Alright, he's taking it from about halfway. Lockie centers it to number 33. 33 keeps it going to JJ number 3. She drops it back to Fish. Fisher Day here, just waiting, very calm. Easy pass to number 42, up the line, and she's holding it. Oh, and that's a turn. Maybe not. There's a call. I think Lockie White is calling a foul. Uncontested foul. It's back to Lockie. Ah, oh, lucky break for Sufa just then. And he's holding it. Disc is back in. Oh, his mark with a great layout. Number 42 with the longest arms. And then 
easily caught by Fisher Day in the end zone to take the game to 11-3. Sufa with a significant lead. All right, we're going to get a pull from Lulu to Deacon on offense. That is spiraling lovely. And he get a roll, stopped by number five quite easily, centers it to 14. And he's looking up. It looks like a pretty junky zone right now. He sends it around to number eight on the sideline. And he's, he's got Patrick Sparks on the mark to five, back to eight, back to five. To 14. This is some lovely handler work. Oh, broke the cup absolutely to number two. And she's keeping it slow. Back to number six. She's ooh, almost a block there. But number eight has it. And he sends it up the line to number five. Centered to six. And it's into the end zone. But blocked by Lulu. Foul call though. It's pretty pretty clear from this perspective that he hit him. But they'll talk it out. It could be completely accidental and maybe the foul's not valid. It looks like it's getting contested right now. A lot of talking's happening. Uh, foul uncontested. A lot of talk for a non-contest. Non really makes you wonder. Oh, retracted. So I guess it's a turnover. Some confusing hand signals were used just then. Did not mean what they represented. Back to Lulu. Crossfield to Pat. He's got it. No mark, up the line, it keeps going to number six, missed it, number seven, he saves the day. And he centers it, oof, but a bounce off the shin means no, no goal. We got eight picking up the disc, it's back to that zone, zone defense, 14 crashing. Easy little pop to 14, up the field to number two, who keeps it going to number seven. Number seven, no one to throw to though. <laughs> He's just too far ahead. He drops it back to number six, who is centering it to five, out to eight, around, and is that in? No. He's on the line. You, you can't get much closer to a goal than this, and he drops it back to number 14, who does Big send across to number seven out in the open. And it looks like Deacon's coming back a bit. After being down 9-1, scores 11-4. Let's watch this pull. It's nice, it's curving out, coming back in. Going a real high floater. I think it went all the way across the field and out. And that's a brick. A pretty impressive curve on that throw. Going all the way around. But just just a bit too much curve actually. Did you end up heading and, uh, out we have line? Molly there, number eleven, the walking base. it to the brick mark. Looks like it's a vert stack with a extra handler out in JJ. Number three. Back to Molly number 11, cross to Lucky. He's, he's looking long, does a wobbly hit, but gets it through to number 33, who centers it to Fisher Day. Easy little flick to number 11. And she is looking to send it up the line. Fisher makes the cut, gets it, and he has number five incredibly open until the wind gets it. Oh, a layout there, like a double layout at least, and uh, bounced it in her hands, but it could not quite keep the grab on it. So Deacon goes to pick it up. Number 14, very casual in his trackies. Picks it up. Looks like it's a vert stack. 
Maybe a bit of poaching going on there. Some super players standing a bit far from their player, but Fisher Day is on his player, making sure he cannot get it when he's running deep. But the deep shot goes off anyway, and no one's there. The throw is actually, yeah, a bit past the line. Oh, we've got 33 there with the disc in the centre of the end zone. Prime for a Callahan, but it's a turnover anyway. 14 quick to pick up the disc. He's looking for something exciting. 22 is being poached off by Fisher Day. He gets it. His hands up. And that's a that's a turn. It was a lovely little put, but did not quite stay in her hands. All right, that's it's a bit of a take two here. Same positions. Is it oof, almost the same throw, but a bit of an upline break this time. Fakes off. Fisher Day, but passes it to him anyway. Fish sends it across to Lockie. Lockie's looking to whip it out, but does not. Just a small upline to number 33. Number 33, passes it to JJ. JJ to 83, almost blocked, but she managed to keep it. Fisher looking long, a nice flick. It's floating. It's floating, going to be a contest, and that's down. That's no goal. Although a lovely flick by Fish there. He really had it. 14, just slowly walking to the Frisbee. He's very casual. He's not even wearing shorts. No shorts, man. Can't believe it. We've got Lucky on the mark. Oof, but that is a breakthrough right there. 22 receives it easily. And he's looking long with that throw. Is 42 going to make it? Nah, it's out. <laughs> Number 11, very confident in herself. Centers it to 33. He passes it to Fisher Day, 98. He's looking back up the field to 33. A great leading pass. And he's, he's looking long, but no one's there. He's... Upline to fish, doesn't go through, centers it to 83. Oh, and I've got some UQ players walking in front of me now. Oh, bloody outrageous. Don't, don't worry, mate. Don't worry about it. Um, and it looks like it was a pick anyway. It's all good. Violation, come on, guys. It's, it's really not your first rodeo. If it's a pick, don't move. But no, number five's got the disc. She's just kind of hanging out. She taps it in. Sends it long very quickly for number 33. And that's a goal. Um, that would be Sufa on 12. Deacon, four. It's, it's an exciting game. All right, this is a pull from Lulu. It's curving around. Lovely, gonna hit that roll. Oh, they they could not stop it. That's out the back. You hate to. It's really. You feel embarrassed. If I'm if I'm getting a frisbee coming at me on the ground, I gotta stop that roll. Otherwise, what am I even doing here? Number 14, casually walking up. No sense of embarrassment in not stopping that roll for him. We're playing flat, playing flat, and it makes sense because that is a big pull to number eight. Catching it in his stride. A lot of steps after that after that catch there. But it's a catch. People are stopping. And it's a goal. Okay, I don't know why everyone stopped. It is a goal. Alright, that's a big pull from number 22 on Deacon. It's swinging around. It's not a brick like last time, it is in. Yeah, wow, what a way to stop a roll. He gets it done. Centered to Fish. He's looking upfield. He's standing very, very casual. Back to Molly. Up to Lockie. He's looking. Ooh, a fake. And a nice little floating, floating flick to 33. He's, he, he tried to activate his other hammer. Lockie gets it. 
Back to 33. He's looking, he's looking. Nothing's happening. No one's doing any cuts. Back to number one with a huge layout by 14, but gets him nowhere. Number five to Molly. Up the line to Fisher. Up the line again to number 40. And he's, he's trying to finish this point, and he does to Molly. Very easy little backhand up the line. And that's 13-5 for Sufa. Deakin do have a lot of fans here. They have two other Deakin teams and University of Melbourne backing them up. You, Sid, hate to say it, but a lot less fans. Fisher Day is wearing UNSW pants. Yeah, Fisher Day repping UNSW shorts right now. Oh, he misses that roll. That is, that is tough. That frisbee is not coming back. It's gone all the way to the footy fields. That frisbee is... It's decided it's found a better home in Seven's footy. 14 has it. Sends it up the line to number 17. Back on after his injury a few points ago. He passes it up. Just missed by five. Might have got it if he laid out. Not too sure. And uh, we're slow on this pass. Lulu's very calm. He's looking. He's looking. Over Varley's head. And 70 catches it, but I'd have to say... Oh! It's in. That's a goal. <laughs> Looks like it might have been out, but hey, I don't have the best perspective here. Everyone's calling it in, and that's 14-5 for Sufa. And like, um... Four at half, and we end up scoring like seven against them. Oh, shit. Uh, it's a, that's a pull from Lulu. It's it's rolled out, though. I wasn't uh, he's done better pulls this game alone. Definitely in his Shrewsbury career, but even the previous pull was better than that. But he's flat on the mark. Centres it to number six. She's looking upfield. She's trying to activate her other handler, but he's, he's faffing around, and that's a block. It's a lovely block. This might be it. These next couple of passes might be the end of the game. Hmm? Should we get up? Hmm? Ah. Number six with the disc. Senders it to Lulu. Bit of a stumble. He's looking upfield. He sends it to Pat Sparks just past his head. Very unfortunate. Alright. Sufa doesn't seem discouraged. They're going to bring it back, or at least. That's the murmurs I'm hearing. Deacon also seems pretty confident they're going to take this point. So we'll see what number 14 can pull. A huge hammer across field, but to no one. And Sufa back in. This might be ending it. No one's walking to the disc. Oh, Lulu walking to the disc. This could be the point. This could be the throw to end the game. It's up. We have a huge hammer across to Waz. And it's in. That's a goal. 15-5. Sufa takes it. Sufa has won Uni Games. Well done to Deacon. Valiant effort. But Sufa, I hope this video goes well. I don't think I have actually introduced myself. My name is Jimmy, manager of the UNSW team. Shout out to the Stubbies.